What's up, YouTube? Welcome to the Aviator Channel. Well, today is oil leak day. Um, I'm going to uh, tell you how I fixed the oil leaks on this engine. This isn't the first time I've battled oil leaks on the Bonanza. Ugh. I don't know how much money I spent on that thing, you know, fixing drip, dripping oil, but uh, it was a lot. And uh, on this Franklin, when I got it, it runs spectacular. But, you know, if you're in aviation and you fly airplanes and they have reciprocating engines, they leak oil and they leak it big time. Um, or what I consider big time. But it, to me, a, a drip is, is big time. Um, so here's the process. So basically what you do is you take the engine cowling off and you hot see the engine uh, that's using really hot water and and blast all the gunk and stuff you know once you get a drip of oil then sand and dust and everything ad adheres to it and it just turns gnarly and it the bottom of the airplane looks like you know the bottom of a grease monkey and so I just hate it so um, I'm gonna walk you through how I did this one and kind of show you the results so here we go so here is the Franklin engine cowling's off uh, because we're doing the uh, kind of avionics upgrade you've got the harness there for the engine analyzer some of the you know mixture stuff and and other push pull cables in there but you'll notice this aircraft has been sitting in this exact spot hasn't moved an inch for two months and there's not one drop of oil there's not one drop of oil coming off of the engine it is perfectly bone dry. So the process here is what we did was we took a vacuum and we put it right on this breather tube, uh, a shot vac, and, and, and put a vacuum inside the engine. That's after we had cleaned the engine with solvents and, and everything to get all the gunk off. And then we went, went around and we painted every single seal up in there around the uh, push-pull tubes and uh, all those nooks and crannies in there with ProSeal. And what happened is the vacuum in the engine kind of pulls that ProSeal into um, the leaky spot and the leak goes away. Now we love oil and we hate oil and we love it we love it and we hate it for the same reasons. We love it because it's you know very viscous and, and we hate it because once it gets on the floor it, it never comes up. But if you just take a half hour and paint all your seals with Pro Seal, those leaks will go away. And that is what we did. So now the test is, you know, is it gonna leak after I run it for 100 hours? I don't know, I'll do another video. But uh, right now I'm pretty happy because when this thing would just sit, it would just drip and drip and drip. And when I say drip, it was probably a quart of oil. <laughs> And, you know, some of it's being burned, some of it's dripping. It's probably a quart of oil every 25 hours or 30 hours. So, you know, not that much, but enough to drive me batty. And so, you know, I think it's going to work because that Pro Seal is great stuff. And um, if it doesn't, I'll do it all again. So, anyways, you like this sort of stuff, like, subscribe, comment. Easy solution to a nasty problem, and uh, you know, hopefully, it helps somebody. Right on. Until next time.